Coronavirus outbreaks are rising globally as over a million cases have been confirmed to date. With the hope to stop the spread of the virus, many businesses, companies and organizations have been forced to close or limit their services. Chapels and religious places of worship are among these closings, but there are still opportunities to use these services online. At Boston College, we're a Jesuit Catholic university, um, so we follow the guidelines of the Archdiocese of Boston. The Archdiocese has suspended masses, so our, our campus community, like many parishes, have been sending out links to online streaming services. Although this doesn't take the place of community gatherings, college chapels, churches and other places of worship are trying to give people a familiar place to come back to. Which of course isn't the same as, as being gathered together in a, in a liturgical worshiping community, um, but especially as Easter approaches and, and we're moving through these days of, of Lent, which is part of our Catholic tradition, having something to connect folks back to their religious teachers, um, I think has been a really important tool and resource for students. With shutdowns until the beginning of May, there's no clear idea on what the future holds. Boston College, among many others, are following guidelines from the Center of Disease Control and Prevention in hopes to return in the fall. As people continue their isolation in all parts of the country and all around the world, there's a need to bring people together that the chapels are trying to spread. A friendly face with some reassuring words is only part of what religious organizations are offering in an attempt to connect with their audiences. Um, especially as students might be scattered all over the country, being able to tune in and see a familiar space and a familiar face, offering words of comfort and hope and um, looking forward to the, the resurrection story that we tell every Easter. As numerous services are being offered, there are ways to request sessions and attend Mass on live video chat. For more information, contact your local churches. From St. Mary's Parish, I'm Martha Constantinides.